Hello everybody and welcome back to another um, yeah, another episode of Overly Requested Add-Ons. Now, um, we're checking out another overly outdated add-on today, as I seem to be very good at doing that. <laughs> yes, today we're finally checking out, um, forever after this released, a admin gun called the Handheld Gustav Cannon. Um, yep, apparently this is, uh, supposed to be stronger than the QTG gun and Jonder wouldn't shut up about it for a whole week, so, um, yeah, we're checking it out, um, <laughs> uh, I don't know why it took me so long to check it out, just don't ask, we're, we're, we're here to review an add-on, not blabber. Anyways, so, the Gustav Cannon has two versions, we have, um, the normal one and the admin one. <laughs> admin, no, no. <laughs> Alright, let's get the normal one. All right, um, that's that's not menacing at all. Uh, <laughs> it appears I'm holding a tank. I don't know what this is. Let me actually let me actually have a look at it. Ooh, oh, <laughs> I don't know what that is, but okay. Yikes. Um, yes, I am holding what appears to be a tank. Um, all right, okay, sure. Yep, that makes lots of sense. Uh, <laughs> Goddamn. I will just take an image of me holding that. <laughs> Oh well. Uh, let's fire it. Alright then. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what exactly I meant to say. Uh, <laughs> uh, I think I may have accidentally blown myself up with this thing. Let's try again. Whoa. Okay. Uh, it's all fire doesn't seem to do anything. Oh, you're meant to reload, it's okay. Yeah, alt fire does absolutely nothing, and um, the primary shoots at what, to, what appears to be a um, miniature nuclear warhead. Okay, then. God, the, the sound design <laughs> on this thing is incredible. Also, what does that say? The Holy Grail is blessed upon you. A weapon system truly meant to be used in the hands of God himself. Um, when the drones were created in the ghost town, Shevko had the brilliant idea to take the tower and condense into one very small point. So small that it can be held in the hands of any person. Oh, there's no trigger. Uh, there's no trigger. Oh, yeah, the button. <laughs> that makes sense. Okay, let's fire it. Yeah, there's not a lot to say about it. It's, it's just... It just fires a bomb. <laughs> But it's probably a really powerful bomb, so we're gonna test it out against some Zambos. Gonna wanna get lots of these. A whole load of these. I lagged for a second and a million zombies spawned in one place. Uh, they're still uh, stuck in the air. <laughs> Alright, let's let them loose. Hmm. Oh, now they wanna chase me. It just took them a bit to. Realize what exactly is going on. You have to really get up in their face for this. Anyways, off we go. Oh. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that that took care of them all, right? Oh, that took care of almost all of them. No, well, only one still alive. Oh wait, no, there's uh, there's a few more still. Damn, the jib's on this thing. <laughs> the thing. Yeah, it's it's really goddamn powerful. I guess we can get like a 30. 30 poison zombies. All in one area. Blow them up. Ah. Okay, yikes. This thing is uh, rather powerful, don't you say? Um, okay. Should we test out the admin version? <laughs> oh Christ, that's right. Um, well, um, I don't know, no, and Jesus. Purpose, it's in Russian. Instructions, it's in Russian. I'm guessing it's meant to be like some sort of communist version, not a German version. Is this meant to portray, um, the Russians destroying the Germans in World War II? I don't know. Um, alright, let's blast them the hell out of everything. Oh, it's spammable. Of course it's spammable. Why wouldn't it be spammable? Oh my god. <laughs> that's, um, that's interesting. Oh, wow. That, that's frightening. <laughs> Oh, 
Yep, okay, there you have it. Uh, <laughs> the handheld Gustav cannon. Yeah. We'll get a bunch of hands ones. Oh, yeah, I blew him up all right. Um, let's get the normal one. Oh, let's get the cartoon cat. Okay, good. I blew myself up in the process. Um, how loud is this gun? It's probably extremely loud. Let's get breaking news. Um, but... Yoink, he's dead. How powerful is this? I'm actually a bit concerned. Oh, he just, he just clapped me, man, of course. Um, alright, let's get ourselves this one. Alright, if one shot's behemoth, what about precursor? Uh, let's get precursor, the strongest shover. Got him. Oh, I need to reload for us, damn it. Alright, if one shot's precursor, so... I'm gonna go under the presumption that this thing can one shot absolutely everything. Uh, <laughs> I'll shot this off. Oh, it kills them too. <laughs> this thing is uh, really strong. All right, what else is there to say about this thing? Uh, <laughs> it's um extremely powerful. I'll try killing the Aogon. Damn, one shots him too. All right, um, well, uh, <laughs> what else are we meant to do with this thing? Let's try to get the. Well, let's get like a dupe. Let's get like some sort of building dupe. Uh, let's get my house. Oh, it's all errors. Um, let's get something else done. Dr. Kleiner Barrel. Oh, no. It's Dr. Kleiner Barrel. Um, I hate it. I hate it a lot. I hate it so much to the point that I'm gonna blow it up. But not with a crossbow. With a Okay, I think that, uh, yeah, but that rid of the, the cliner, all right. Uh, <laughs> all right, let's get a destructible house. We'll actually get a bunch of destructible homes. We're gonna get a load of these. Like, a lot of these. Let's actually just, like, look at one. Let's see what it looks like from the inside. Seems like a really basic house. I'll just have this one on Frozen for the funnies. Yeah, uh, really, really basic house. I can... Uh, oh, what happened to my crossbow? <laughs> uh, my crossbow fuel model kind of broke. Look out of the windows. Okay, I'm, gonna just, I'm gonna just make a hole in the house to get out of skirt. Give me my crossbow. I'm gonna need to blow everything up now. Ah! Uh oh. <laughs> wow. Yep, that blew, that blew most of the houses up. It didn't blow up all of them. Yeah, um, there's clearly not a lot left of these house renditions. I mean, th <laughs> this one doesn't even have a house. It's just a platform. <laughs> yeah, oh, that one's a bit on fire. Um, oh, yikes. This one seems to be the most stable house in proximity to the explosion. Like, um, it, it got, it got, everything got pretty goddamn destroyed. Let's, let's blow the rest of it up. Uh-oh. Oh yeah, the frames be dropping. Nope, and I killed myself. <laughs> wow, incredible. Uh, <laughs> let's get ourselves another gas. Yeah, okay, let's clean up everything. Okay, let's get another dupe. Let's try destructible fortress. Not not a house. This is a whole ass fortress. Um, um, we should get like bomb. We need to get like bomb bunkers and test them uh, um, up uh, up against the Gustav. So this seems to be a normal cardboard box, um, castle slash fort slash whatever. Uh, let's just hop onto this and just take a nice little tour of what this actually looks like. The only way to climb the stairs is to crouch jump on them, and you need two hands for that. And then um, yep, you're on top. You have to no clip to actually get on top. Yep, a nice little fortress. I like it. It seems to be kind of collapsing. <laughs> I don't know. All right, um, we're gonna be getting real far away. Let's blow it up. Uh oh, hopefully that don't crash our game. Oh yikes. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's really bad. Oh, that's so bad. <laughs> well, the Gustav made quick work of the fortress. Yeah, it, it, it's 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 really messed up. 
it, it's incredibly messed up. Oh my god. <laughs> Yikes, look, wood splinters went all the way over there. Yeah. For a fortress, not very stable. We've we've managed to conclude that. The CSS house. M9K content? Sorry, I don't have it. Um Mini Bunker. Okay, so this should be a miniature bomb bunker. Um, resistance against some um, small high power explosives. So, um, all right. So you got yourself an elevator. So it's elevated up in the sky. So if there's an explosion on the ground floor, the tippity top of the bunker will be a okay. So yeah, we got. Or is this a protective fence and not the actual bunker itself? Ooh, maybe this is like a protective fence to protect it from um any explosives. Yeah, see, not a scratch. Um, let's actually step inside. Ooh, alright, we're in. Okay, so you have up and down switches, a table, and a chair. <laughs> uh, I'll actually just get back up inside of the elevator. We have, like, screens here. Let's go up. I think I'm gonna freeze it first. Hmm. Are, are we- are we moving? Is this thing going up? It, it doesn't seem to be moving. Uh... Oh, that's a shame. How about down? Oh, oh, it is a- oh, it is a fence. Never mind. I, I figured it out, guys. It took me a while. <laughs> this thing is meant to be unfrozen, and, um, here's how it works, essentially. Um, this is meant to be like a shield. You get in, you pull it down. Yeah, damn it, it isn't working. <laughs> oh, Francis. Yeah. You're meant to pull the fence down and then it, like, shields you from any kind of bomb. Oh, yep, there we go. Oh, nice. You got to protect the fence up, so this should be fully shielded from any explosive, but probably not when we got down. In flames it goes. Hang on a minute. Oh! Yo, it worked, kinda. Uh, I mean, it did its job, but the gate is kind of collapsed and everything is a bit on fire. Ouch. Uh, well, it worked, kinda. Mm, I don't know what to say. Um, the Gustav um, did quite some damage. I'd say we should give <laughs> the mini bunker a round two. Oh yeah, it, it definitely won't survive a second round. This thing is done for good zones. Um, yeah, no way, Jose. Let's look for another protective house. Hmm. SB5? Hmm. Okay, I don't know what this is. It seems to be a well. Hmm, it's obviously not meant for protection against explosives. It's mainly just a decoration. Yeah, it just blew up. Blood went everywhere. <laughs> oh, I trained here. <laughs> you know what? Because I hate these charms and dupes so goddamn much. I'm gonna make quick work of this train eater. Uh, with my gun staff. Screw all bad Trevor dupes. Oh, god damn it, lift. Give me the admin one. Oh, yeah, that did it. Um. <laughs> yeah, um. This, this, I don't know what to say. Uh, <laughs> yeah, this thing clearly isn't train eater anymore. Um, <laughs> let's carry on. Okay, nuke shelter. Okay. There should be another protective bomb shelter against, um, powerful high, um, power explosives. Okay. So it appears we have a sliding door, which doesn't really work. Um, that's a shame. We'll hop inside. So this thing is meant to shield you against nukes. Uh, we're gonna get ourselves a little test subject. We're gonna get a citizen and his name is Jeremy. Say hi to Jeremy, guys. Well, Jeremy's gonna die. Ooh. Yo, it's actually resistant, kinda. Uh, the Jeremy live? Yo, he only took like a speck of damage. This thing is actually protective in... Gun real quick. Um, can I freeze time real quick? Uh, how do I freeze time? Help. <laughs> time stop. Okay, there we go. Time stop. We're gonna get ourselves the Gustav. And that right there, friends, is our Gustav shell. 
Super high powered explosive, this thing is gonna kill us. But I'm gonna get inside of my little hot swift, Jeremy. And hopefully, we're gonna live once the bombs go off. You ready, Jeremy? Oh, okay. <laughs> yep, it, it, it didn't put, protect us for a round two. Oh no. Uh, <laughs> well, that didn't work. Okay, let's find something else to protect us from it. Uh, okay. Let's see here. What's something that could potentially protect us? Hmm. Oh shit. God, we have so many oceans in my channel. Oh no, there's more. <laughs> In my channel, in my country. We have many, many Oshans. Is this meant to be your typical Oshan? Because it doesn't look like it. Um, well, I'm gonna be testing this Oshan up against my handheld Gustav cannon. See if it does any good. Alright, Oshan, you better protect me from, uh, hell itself. Uh, I'm gonna die. Here it comes! Go! Oh, 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 this thing is protecting me, god damn it. Uh, well, I would have most certainly died right there. There's no way I would have survived that, but, um, the Oshan looks like it could survive around, too. I mean, the sign is kind of coming off, but oh well. <laughs> Let's carry on. Armored Vault, okay. So, we got ourselves an Armored Vault. Um, this thing looks, um, quite high-tech, quite secure. Hmm. And yep, it does contain guns. Ooh, give me all those. Yep. Ugh, okay. So it seems as if we got a protective screen and a valve, which I'm produce which I'm presuming is gonna Yep, keep us nice and safe. Ooh. Yep, door's nice clamped and shot. Um let's just unfreeze this. Alright, let's get ourselves the Q tug. And we're gonna go way up into the sky. And we're gonna nuke this thing. Oh, I forgot the freeze time. Ah, that it live. I'm not gonna spoil it for myself. It looked pretty. Time stop, all on. Okay, the Gustav is, um, on its way to the vault, so, um, we better start protecting ourselves with some kits and stuff. Quick, shut the emergency doors. I said quick, shut the emergency doors. It doesn't work. The doors don't work. Well, we don't need doors, do we? Doors are for losers. Here we go. Oh, I died. <laughs> Damn, we need something that can protect me, bro. Like, I can even shut the door. Oh, oh because it wasn't, un it wasn't unfrozen. God damn it. Okay, we need we need something that's gonna actually protect me. Let's actually thoroughly look for something. Uh, gas station. A nice little home. Amazing shop. Yeah, that's totally gonna protect me. <laughs> Pizzeria Freddy Fazbear. <laughs> Why do I want to try that? <laughs> Why do I want to try that? That that actually sounds kind of cool. <laughs> All right. Mm, it seems as if it's taken a while to load up Pizzeria Freddy Fazbear. Oh, wow! It's Pizzeria Freddy Fazbear. I hate it so goddamn much. I'm gonna nuke it. Yeah, come over to Freddy Fazfox. We got, um, this place being bombarded with Gustav cannons every now and then, but it's alright, you're gonna live. It, it's very secure. <laughs> God damn it, I need a new bunker. Um, okay. Oh, that's a bit racist. Kekistan music. Mini construct, fence from Jurassic Park, surprise house version 3, jail. Ooh, factory. Bread made it, not me. <laughs> Maybe this factory with airs on it, the air factory, it could, it's sliding, it, it's sliding. <laughs> it could maybe protect us from the handheld Gustav cannon. So we're gonna turn the time stop on. We're gonna get ourselves a Gustav. And there it is, our Gustav warhead. 
Sound the air raid sirens. We're gonna hide inside the air factory. Hopefully it's gonna shield us from the Gustav cannon. Uh, holy shit, this place is actually kind of huge. Um, I'll keep the security doors clamped shut. No, but there isn't really a lot to the snow, is there? Uh, where do we hide? <laughs> we need a place to live. Locked. It's locked. I'm gonna stay right... Um, out of the missiles course. Well, the missile is gonna hit this side of the factory, so I'm gonna stay here with my new friend. Um, uh, retard. Um, let's get nuked. <laughs> Watch out! Ooh, yeah! Uh, time for the, uh, durability test. Did this place didn't survive? It doesn't look like it. The door came right off. Yeah, it's on fire. Nominal damage has occurred, not too much. Alright, let's get another dupe. Let's get something nice. Okay, we're gonna get, uh, hmm. How about a whole ass skyscraper? The Game Crasher. I'll pass on the Game Crasher, my friend. Ooh. Seems to be like a whole ass prop, like, it's, it's not even a building. So what's the point of testing it? War bunker, okay, this thing looks like it's made for proper nuclear warheads, um, okay, so welcome to war bunker, it doesn't look like a lot, <laughs> oh no, uh, I, I don't have high hopes in this, I really don't, this thing is not gonna survive a goddamn blast, <laughs> oh, Still standing, let's go, not on fire, not anything. Wow, it actually did survive, but I don't think that one person would survive in it, which is what I'm trying to do here. Or maybe Chef made the unsurvivable gun. Overuse jail dupe. <laughs> that pool mansion treehouse zombie base. Ooh. Fridge, mini citadel, destroyable world trade center. I'm gonna make a very offensive joke. Um <laughs> Yeah, instead of two planes, it's a Gustav cannon. Well, this is scenic. Yo, it's 9-11-2, let's go. What is this thing made of? It's made of scaffolding. This thing is literally made of scaffolding. How, how do you think this thing is gonna survive a nuke? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm lagging really goddamn bad. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, clearly, um, didn't really survive. Okay. Okay, what else do we have? Bank, trap, sky base, bomb. B -b 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 bomb. Okay, let's get a bunker. This is bunker V2.0, and we're gonna get a test subject to survive inside of the bunker. Um, let's see who it is. His name is, um, uh, Crackhead. Um, okay, so this doesn't look like a lot, but maybe I believe that this could potentially survive a shot from the Gustav. Um, first test. No, oh, he's that. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> oh, fi. It didn't survive one. Okay, well, we've had, um, bits and pieces of the wall come off. Um,. <laughs> Oh, the door got kind of blasted open. Uh, something broke over here. Um, oh, yep, yeah, there he is. He's, he's dead. He, he's really dead. Oh, no. <laughs> Poor crackhead. Oh, yep, yeah, this place is still falling apart. It's quaking. Yeah, I clearly cannot survive a shot from one. Okay, let's get something else. Okay. Um. Epic House of Houseness. Um, hopefully this can survive a shot or two from the Gustav. So here's the Epic House of Houseness. Um, our citizen test subject is gonna be standing up here. Um, he is, um, Crackhead's brother, Crackety Head. And then we have, um, Sahela. <laughs> I don't know why I thought of that name first. And then we're gonna get, uh... There we go. Uh, they even have a balcony. Let's go. Uh, we're gonna place a guy on the top of the building. I'm not even gonna name them anymore, but the better Okay, so we have a bunch of test subjects in this house, and we're gonna be putting it to the test. Um, 
This is probably the last test I'm gonna do because this video is really long. You guys can probably do this yourselves. Hiya! Everybody's gonna die. Ooh! Only three people died, and one person didn't even die from the explosion. Hmm. This seems viable! Okay, so bits and pieces of it fell off. Uh, some of it broke. Uh, this guy is missing a head and a leg. <laughs> oh, you're still alive. Full health. Nice. Hmm. Oh, you're still alive, even though floorboard nearly hit your head. That could have potentially killed you. You're still alive. Oh, the roof. Oh, 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 this guy. Oh, oh, the roof. The roof. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna be hopping in. I'm gonna be hopping in. And I'm gonna try to survive the Gustav. Alright, are you ready? We're gonna get inside and we're gonna try to live. Um, okay. This is gonna be my hiding spot. We're running away from a nuclear warhead. I'm literally gonna die. Ah. <laughs> well, hopefully we'll be fine. I'm gonna die. Oh! Whoa! Wait, whoa! Oh, the fire killed me. The actual explosion didn't. Wow. And this guy's still alive. What a champ. He didn't even take any damage. Let's see how many more nukes it'll take to kill. Um, the tower. Two more citizens died. Yeah, the thing is falling apart. I think three nukes is the most that this thing can take maximum. Look at this thing. Look at the state of this thing. Okay, fine. I'll do one more test because this is fun. I want like a really, really fucking big house. Oh, huge destructible base. This is the best. Oh my, this looks really unstable. I'm better off. Okay. Let's get the QTG gun, let's uh, pause time, let's uh, hop inside, and let's see what happens. In the huge destructible base. I didn't even summon in a nuke one. Yeah, I want this to be like the Gustav airstrike. Um, okay, so is time frozen? Yep, it is frozen. Yep, okay, let's uh, hop down and then we're gonna get um, bombed like we're in Ukraine, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's hop right in. Ooh, very unstable. Uh, there was a nuke. We're all gonna die! Oh shit. Oh, it fell right there. Cool. Oh. Nah. Uh, uh, yeah, it's not too stable, is it? Nah. Yeah, I don't use destructible bases for nukes, otherwise this will happen. Ah, uh, well, uh, that's bad, is it? Oh, no. Oh, it's really bad. Oh, it's really bad. Oh, it's really bad. Oh, it's really bad. Oh, it's really, it's, it's, it's really bad. It's really bad. Wow, um, is that, that's a rub right there. Um, <laughs> yeah, whole thing fell. Um, whole thing got torn to total shreds by the Gustav. Yeah, I think that's a wrap on this video. Um, damn, that, this video is almost half an hour. Well, see you later.